So when people don't hear well, it really isolates them and it um, creates a lot of barriers for them in terms of being able to connect and, and, and communicate with people in their community and their family. There are about 16 million people in Zambia and there's only one audiologist in the whole country. <laughs> Mommy, that was kind of a close one. Yay! Oh, she is adorable. <laughs> So he says, according to what he's seen, there is hope that the, the daughter will be able to speak. So he's very grateful for what has happened. Yes. Say mama. Will you say mama? Will you do it today? <laughs> See? What's a dog gonna do to help you get across the world to help other people? Well, it's so amazing to actually be here and actually be able to help other people because I never thought that they'd actually be here helping people when I made my first video. So it's amazing that my expectation has actually become a reality. I'm really excited because there's one patient in particular, her name is Sylvia, it's a little girl. She's going to be five soon. We identified her two years ago. She has hearing loss and didn't have any speech or language at the time. I was just basically living in a very silent world. So she's coming today and I'm excited to see her. Oh. Look, she has hearing needs like you. Just like you, he has hearing needs too, see? Look. Yes, Yay. very good. All the time, when they would get hearing aids, they would usually smile and be in joy. And I would just love that feeling that I've helped someone be able to hear. And it was so exciting when I saw someone actually be able to hear. Yeah. 